Namaste. Hi. Today's class is about adapting and challenging. And that's what's good about home practice because we can utilize the things around the house to serve as our yoga props. For example, chairs, folded blankets, block or timber or stack of books, or even if you have a pair of dumbbells at home. So I will be sharing with you a personal practice of mine. Uh, I do this every morning. Uh, short one, yeah, very doable and adaptable. All right, so standing tall, uh, grabbing hold of your dumbbells there. Yeah, or you can what use like bottled water, or yeah, yeah, anything which you can yeah, just use to create a mild resistance. Um, yes, if you're uh, um, gifted with the strength, you know, you can do heavy ones too. This is like a pair of five kg dumbbells. All right, standing tall. Yeah, with the feet hip width distance. All right, bending and then pushing yeah the weights over the head. Yes, yeah, so sitting. Pressing, bending, and upright. So that's one repetition. We're gonna do 20, all right? And then the breath. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, that's two. Three. Sit, press, sit, and done. All right, so keep going. So when you set your hips low, you're not too low to the point that your knees go past your toes. Now, to adapt, yeah, just make the range of movement small. Yeah. Sitting, inhale, push, exhale, stand. Sit, up. All right, let's do four more. Inhale. Quite cardiovascular, the sequence. Sit, press, down, and up. Yeah. If the body is warm already, yeah, you can seat deeply, yeah, but of course, yeah, do it progressively. Can we do two more? Yeah, good to do extras. Up, down, and rise. One last, inhale. Press, down, and up, yeah. All right, from here, quickly, drop them. All right, hold on to a chair, lift, lift leg high. Good, you might pendulum forward and back. Good, stay, All right, and we're gonna fold the knee. And then we're doing this about four times. How to breathe, exhale to hug, inhale, kick. Good. And then from here, yeah, that left foot steps up and lunge your right leg back. All right. So, yeah, easy one. Just keep your hands supporting you there or no hands. You're hovering, yeah, a lunge position with an element of arm balance. Or you can do, yeah, and this one, yeah, if you want, yeah a little bit of a lunge position or try yeah grabbing hold of your dumbbells again yeah and then lifting upright yeah rising good sitting and up down and up all right so this is the advanced version yeah if you want any of those yeah easier ones yeah down and up down and up. So just bending up and down. Keep going. Good. Up and down. If you want to take a break here, you can rest your dumbbells closer to you. Or you can even add the pushing down and open. Three more. Good. Three, two, ready? One. Good. And then free it. All right. Support. Changing leg, lifting the left leg high, and then stay. Good. Good. Holding. All right, why not? Try, yeah? Do it with me. Grabbing hold of your plates. And then out to the side. Good. Just as many as you can do. Good. To adapt, yeah, without the plates. Yeah. And then maybe just one arm, or try both arms, yeah? Continue. Five, four, three, two, let's do extra, 
Extra three. Three. Two. And one. All right. Drop it down, hands down, step back, and do a downward dog. All right, bend and stretch, and then moving the hips side to side, breathing in, breathing out. All right, coming forward, shoulders over the hands, knees or toes, exhale down, and then rest the head, recover. All right, ready, inhale, opening, good, sitting back, exhaling, yeah, not yet. Uh, step up your right foot between hands, heel down, hold to a chair or just a free flowing second warrior position. Breathe. Good. Recover the breath. Inhale, rise and open. Good. Wide hands. You may start below the knee or slide down to the ankle, or you can grab your support. Yeah, in practicing the triangle position. Yeah, just flatten, breathing this one, inhaling, exhaling. All right, refold the knee. Yeah, set the side of prop, reversing the arm. All right, straighten the leg. All right, and then opening your left knee. Place your forearm to your thigh and stretch your right side. Breathe this one. Inhaling, exhaling, one last time. All right, we're gonna flow. Yeah, inhale, rise and open, exhale, bend. All right, maybe three or four times just to break the stagnation. All right, and then from there, back to the floor, and hands and then toes forward. Prepare your plates or your dumbbells again. All right, open them wide, sitting. And then we bicep curl, yeah? Good. Try, how about 20, yeah? So how do you breathe this one? Yeah, inhale, exhale. Or you can reverse the breath pattern. Exhale as you, yeah, curl your arms, inhale to open. Or you can just breathe normally here, yeah? Pull the core in, legs engage. Yeah. In here, we're doing compound exercise already. Opening the hips, strengthening the legs, strengthening the core, strengthening the arms, strengthening the shoulders. It's a total body workout this time. How about five more? Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, bend your knees. Dropping down, down, down. Pivoting again to the front. Stay. All right. Left hand is a pushing hand. Open to the side press. Inhalation. Hand down. Lift the left leg high to the back. And prepare. Step up. Your left foot. Yeah. Heart rate up. Good. And then rise. Good. And then hover. Breathe. Again, option one. Stay here. Option two, no hands. Option three, with a prop. And then just stay, breathing in, breathing out, inhaling, exhaling. Two more times. Hovering, hovering. All right, ready? All right, step, change legs, all right? You can just keep wide, yeah, or upright, or grab hold of your dumbbells again. Good. Lift, bend, and rise. All right, many things yeah, you can do to adapt here. Yeah, either you can just rest yeah, to a bicep curl like this, or down, or you can even do this, bend, and rise. Yeah, sometimes, yeah, what I do is I keep them high, touching the dumbbells, and bend and stretch. But this is advanced, yeah, unless they're quite strong. Yeah, you don't do this, yeah? How about five more? Keep going. Five, four, three, two, extra three. Go. Three, two, and one, rise, 
dropping them down with care. Yeah, what do we do? Hands press. All right, downward facing dog. Yeah, just to bend and stretch there, side to side. Hover forward, inhalation. Lower down, exhalation. Push the earth away, inhalation. Exhale to the back. Ready, lift what up. All the way up. Stay. Grabbing hold, hover forward. Ready, good. Keep going. Yeah, your lateral, your side lateral raises, but with the component of the leg balance, with the component of what? Core awareness and the breath. Yeah. Inhale, exhale, breathing in, exhale out. Yeah. Sweating now. Let's try five more. Five. Four, three, you can even go flat here. Two, one, extra so good. Four, three, two, and one. Drop them down, changing legs. Breathe this one, exhale out. Inhaling, exhaling, left hand pressing. Circle round, swim the hand down, lift leg up. And then step up, the left foot forward, heel down, second warrior to the side. Good, beautiful. Now breathing in, breathing out, keeping your left knee bent. Rest straight in the leg, reach high and back, open wide, inhale, hover, and you do your triangle position, almost there. Yeah, adapt or challenge. The principle, adapting and challenging. Now don't lock the knee here. You keep breathing to the flat surface to adapt. Just rest the hand or slightly bend the knee. Stay, thousand three, thousand two, and one. All right, refold the knee, reaching up. All right, straighten, change leg, right forearm to your thigh, and stretch your left shoulder and staying, breathing in, breathing out, inhaling, exhaling, ready to flow, yeah, inhale, reach and hover, exhale, bending, inhale, open, exhale, bending, two more times, breathing in, breathing out, inhaling, Exhaling, all right, changing and then dropping. All right, grabbing hold of your dumbbells again. All right, legs apart, bending, sitting. Can you parallel your thighs to the ground already? Yeah, with your toes slightly turned out, bicep in, and then don't bounce the body. Keep the body still. Just focusing, yeah, on the bending and yeah, the extension of the arms. Well, strong, yeah. you're strong. If you want to invest on like a strengthening equipment at home, a pair of dumbbells, really worth the investment. And they are affordable and then you can choose yeah, the resistance right for you. I suggest a minimum of like um, two kg. Yeah, for general practice. Yeah. Or if you're strong, you can go five, such as this. You can even go higher. Yeah, but I don't suggest going really heavy because we're doing compound exercises, which require stability. Yeah. I lost track of the counting, but keep going. Yes, feel the burn. How about five, four, three, two, and one. All right, how about two more? Two, one. All right, bending your knees, sit care, pull the core in, and then skirt to the front of your mat. Pressing hands and stretch long behind you. Inhale, hover forward, core strong, exhale down. All right, rest. Inhale, flipping up. Exhale to the back, we're doing two more. Breathing in, 
hub over the shoulders. Exhale, knees or toes. And then rest. Inhale, flip in. Exhale. All right, you may stay here for five recovery breaths or buffing the lungs. Four, three, two, and one. Lighten your hips. Inhale. Exhale, then back. All right, shift forward again. Yeah, strong. Exhale to the floor. Rest. Head falls. Shoulders relax. Inhale, flipping. Yeah, knees to pull you. Exhale back. Yeah, buffering the lungs. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, hips light. Exhale, hips back. Yeah, shoulders over the hands. Strong, pull the core in. No banana shape back. Exhale. Yeah, rest. Breathe up the spine. Good. Exhale to the back. Last round. Buffering the lungs. Three, two, one. Lighten hips. And exhale back. Step, jump, or walk outside the hand, but make sure yeah, you have that freedom to do the next one. Yeah, stepping out and then sitting as slow as your hips feel the lightness, or you can sit on your prop. Good. Sitting low. Exhale. Breathing in. You may walk the heels there. Exhaling. Good. And we finish with strength. Yeah, strength. At the end of the day, when you have a strong body, strong muscles, strong bones, strong joints, the internal system becomes strong too. All right, pressing through the hand. All right, rise up. You may stay on your tippy toe or try to rise there. Yeah, after those <laughs> dumbbell workout, you know, stability. Yeah, it's all right to fall here. Remain 1,003. Thousand two, thousand one, extra, thousand three, thousand two, thousand one, and then sit and touch the ground. Good. Quite meditative, yeah? Meditative in the way that you challenge your mental faculties, yeah? You move the body, yeah? And then there's no time for the brain to wander around. Good. Yeah. And you might use now your blanket in supporting your reclining position. All right, and circle around here. Hugging and releasing. Pushing and opening. Yeah. We allow your hips to move from side to side. Good. So the feel of our class today is very different, yeah? And personally, I love the combination of yoga yeah? and resistance training. And then they go together really so well you know, because resistance training is quite inward and there's this breath component too like the breath and the movement they happen in perfect unison coordination yeah, because if you breathe yeah, you are accessing the internal system, yeah? you're accessing the potential of your spine, the hips and the core, and then the brain. It's really coordination, the bandhas. Yeah? Good. And we just give this time for our bodies to relax. Good. So feeling accomplished, yeah? Breathing in, allow your eyes to lightly magnetize yeah, the optic muscles and the nerves up to your forehead. And exhale down.
adapting and challenging. For me, that's the essence of the physical observances of uh, yoga. And any physical strengthening discipline for that matter, while you're building uh, the strength, the flexibility, and the mobility, utilize the support around you. And they do not have to be the fancy, expensive, flashy ones. You don't even need to have a purchase or become a member of a gym or a yoga studio for that matter. Yeah, but yeah, to have a guide is ideal for a safe and long-term progressive practice. Yeah? Hopefully I'm able to help you, you know, through this classes I share with you. All right, so hugging the knees, circle them around. Yeah. If you want to continue your relaxation, yeah, you can do it after our closing. All right, and uh, tucking to the side, and then up to your sitting again. Sweet. All right. Day sorted. Body strong. Yeah. Heart, lungs. Yeah. We work on our cardio fitness, yeah, muscular strength, bone strength, balance, and the brain. Yeah. What else can we ask for? Yeah. Really, just you know, be grateful for the breath, inhaling and exhaling. You know, for the body, for the breath, for the brain. And then for the gift, yeah, to breathe, to move, yeah, to follow. And one last time, yes, I wish you yeah, happiness, content, protection, warmth, peace. Good. And seal the hands and bow over hearts. Namaste, everyone. Good. Thank you. And I'll catch you in the next one.